Good evening, welcome to Tolga Park and League of Ireland TV. Tonight's contest welcomes Dundalk. Should be an absolute fantastic game tonight. So we'll take a look at the, the sides and how they line out tonight. The strong, strong Shelburne side. So we've got Brendan Clark, Luke Byrne, Connor Kane, who's on fantastic form, Aaron O'Driscoll, Shane Griffin, JJ Lunny, Brian McManus, Yad Hakiki, Sean Boyd, Jack Moylan, and Shane Farrell. We'll take a look at the Dundalk lineup with Nathan Shepard, Lewis McCarry, Andy Boyle, Mark Connolly, Daniel Kelly, Robbie Benson, Greg Sloggett, Dara Leahy, Stephen Bradley, Paul Doyle, and David McMillan. Boyle now for Dundalk. Making it through and a big chance here for Dundalk to take the lead. And can you believe it? You thought it was a sure thing. And <laughs> you can hear it from the fans below us. I don't think I think they expected it to go in as well, but that's an absolute sitter missed from yeah, Robbie Benson. It's the man you wanted on it too. There was kind of a little maybe a little bit of luck for it to come through to him, but Look at Brandon Clark's so experienced, and he was a huge signer for Shells, you know. Um, you know just been there, done that kind of keeper. That's a wonderful pass out. And it comes off to Lewis McCary. Back post, big chance here for Dundalk. I think he just lost his footing there, David McMillan. It was a great ball in, he, he got the other side of him. I think it was a Driscoll had a hold of him as well, just to make sure he wasn't going to get it cleanly. So it's a good ball in as well, isn't it? Just looking at it there from McCarry. Stephen Bradley does well. Slog it. Works it towards the opposite side. Moylan wins that bum back for Shelburne. Now can they push forward? Maybe make an opportunity happen. The right option here. Here's Moylan again. He's going to set this one up for Shane Farrell. And it's just straight at Shepard. Another chance. Good start for, for J.R. Wilson there, he's got on it, he's drove at them, it's about the edge of the box, it's probably the man you want there, Shane Farrell, but he's on his left foot there, he probably would have rather than on his right. He's run his legs off this evening, as you said. A long, lofted ball up towards Boyd. Does well, a chance here for Farrell! Massive, massive save from Nathan Shepard. That is a big, big save from Shepard, and Shane Farrell done the right thing. He just latched on to the end of it, and that was another big chance for Shelburne. Oh, I was bringing a head down as well from Boyd. Uh, opportunity, Shepard could not make himself big. But ultimately, I can see his frustration because from where we were standing here, it didn't look offside. Well, looped in by Connolly, and another big chance here for Dundalk. And that's it. It's all over. Wow. Rhino came with the final chance for Dundalk. And you got to hit the target at least there, but look. And we've come to full time here at Tolka Park. Shelburne nil, Dundalk nil. It's all a shift. That's the minimum, and now they'll always give us that. Um, I think we lacked a, probably a bit of quality offensively. Um, didn't create much. Um, obviously, they had two pretty decent chances but outside of that uh, felt good and compact all all night that's what we're trying to build everything around so um, yeah listen it's a point that I guess we'll take but like I said to you before the game it just wasn't uh, we're always looking to win every game so the lads are in there disappointed and I guess I'm happy that they're disappointed um, you know first division team coming up might take a point before a game against a Dundalk team that are flying, that have won whatever, 6-7 on the bounce, 7 out of 8, I don't know. Um, they probably might take that, but us now, like I said, we believe we can beat anyone, and I'm happy that they're not happy. Frustrating result, but I think at the end we have to accept the point. Um, I think for the latter part, maybe the last 30 minutes of the first half, we had an element of, we had a good element of control in the game. But we weren't really able to build on that in the second half um, to the extent that we would have liked. So look, it's 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 part of the development process of the team. Um, we're not there yet. There's plenty of improvement to come. Um, so we'll take the point and we'll move on to the next game.